Hey y'all, Salty Intuition Tarot. I've got three stacks. You, them, and what's going to become of this. So, I'm going to start out seeing what the tarot has to say. Um, three of Cups in reverse. Arguments and misunderstandings. Confused feelings. Maybe you're feeling lonely and isolated. You need to take care of yourself. That's overall energy, what you need to do, regardless of what these say. Um, also says lack of clear thinking. Maybe you have a hard time thinking, you can't think clearly, okay? Why is that? Let's see, your energy is a gift. Maybe you've got them a gift. For Christmas, it is Christmas time, or just a gift in general. What are they thinking? Journey. Maybe they're wanting to take you somewhere, or maybe they're not around at this time. Maybe they don't. Maybe they're. They don't live where you do. Let's put it that way. Here is occupation. Maybe they're gone because of their job. My dogs are playing, so. You got a gift to give them. They're not around because of their job. Or their job keeps them away from you. Seems like they're always gone. Card that was already up. They... The lovers in reverse. Uh, maybe interference in family. Maybe the in-laws don't want you to be together. Or maybe they're taking a journey or trip away from you so that they can get their head clear. They say they're working. Have the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. There's dishonesty in business. Yep, they've said they're out working. They're not. Yeah. Stable individual emperor. You're looking at them like the emperor. Like somebody stable. Somebody that... Uh, I don't know. To me, the emperor's, emperor's kind of narcissist, to be honest. And if you don't know what that is, you know, rules with the iron fist, his way of the highway type of individual. You want to, you know, have something happy with them. And they're just wanting to go, you know, say they got to work. They got to get out. But guess what? The tower's going to go. Uh, tower's coming because you're not going to put up this shit much longer. You're not going to put up with it. See how you're feeling about them romantically. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. You'll find somebody else. And what are they thinking about romantically? Love yourself first. They're, your self-respect makes you more attractive. Maybe they're loving their self first. They're taking care of their wants and needs first. Which is what the emperor does. They are the emperor. Oh. Which could be Emperor is Aries card, but you know, anybody can be in their Emperor energy. Sorry about my dogs. <laughs> They're silly. They're playing, so nothing I can do about that. The outcome is the occupation is taking them away. Playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Maybe you need to put a little fun in the situation. Maybe they're staying away because um, they're trying to take care of themselves. Three of Swords. But it looks like it's going to end in heartbreak. Uh, two of Cups. And they found a new love affair. Sorry about that. Or you need to find a new love affair because this person's going to only leave and break your heart. 
And that's what I'm going with. They're going to leave break your heart. Let's see. The right way. Learning to create what you desire. Maybe you'll change jobs, occupations that will help you to have more time to be more playful. Let's see what it says about them. Law is not not justice. Rules that are not fair. Maybe somebody's got up some boundaries for this person. And you put up boundaries and they don't like it. They don't like rules and regulations. So that's why they're leaving, going on their little journey. And they're loving themselves. You, on the other hand... You know, look at them as a gift. Uh, you're trying to think positive in this romance. It says, a moment's regret, nostalgia, idealizing the past, fearing you've made a mistake, and you're fearing you made a mistake with this person trying to be in their life because you're wanting to offer them something and they're wanting to go away. Or they want to play. It will say their occupations took them somewhere. <laughs> You're trying, it looks like to me that she's trying to turn a frog into a prince. And it's really just a frog. Never going to be a prince. What you thought was an illusion. Let's see what else we can say about this. The strength, Tar uh, card of tolerance, a uh, character comp uh, compassion. It says, "Don't get angry. Have the strength to walk away." It also, is a uh, page of swords. Because this person was an imposter. He was not about what he said he was going to be about. Obviously, that he or she lied to you. They lie to you. They come in, you know. Obviously, just wanting to love themselves. Not offer you anything. But you're looking at them as a gift. You're trying to turn a frog into a prince. King of Pentacles. Um... This person likes expensive cars and stuff like that. They're very materialistic. And they don't want the happy home. All they do is betray. If they make people lose their home and friends and get you, you know, out by yourself, and you lose your family, friends, and everything for them. What do they do? They walk away. <coughs> she, said, she said, that's right. Okay, puppies, get down. <laughs> Maybe you need to pay attention to the people that want to pay attention to you. And here's the devil in reverse, inability to make a decision, look for an easy score. Uh, Self-understanding personal improvement is possible with effort. Money trouble. Maybe because they got money trouble, they just go from people to people. Maybe you run out of money. Because this person, they're no longer interested. That's what could be with this dude. All right, y'all, get down. We get a little thing straightened up here.
So you're messing with somebody that's a player that's all about themselves, that takes off whenever they, you know, drain your drive, your money, finances. You're thinking this is a prince who was just a frog, honey. It's just a frog. Or vice versa. They're just coming in to play. Uh, they come in and, you know, just give you breadcrumb in you. Just to get you stuck so they can take off. They don't think it's fair. They don't think it's fair. Law is not just. They don't think that's fair. That you act that way, but, you know, people got to have boundaries. Let them go off on their little journey. All right. Hangman reverse. Contradiction. Confuse the time ahead. Put aside any selfish interest. May be necessary to sacrifice in order to achieve success. Instead of trying to control the situation and people, leave them alone. Yeah, this telling you leave that type of person alone. You don't need that type of person in your life. They're going to treat you like that. Four of Wands, because you deserve a, a happy home. You deserve everything. You deserve to feel alive and happy with somebody who wants to be happy with you, and that's your that's your goal right there. <laughs> My dogs are obviously having a good time, so maybe you need to get out and play more. Pentacles, uh, Queen of Pentacles, Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn person might be in your life. Maybe this is you. You got fire signs also. Um, <laughs> It says, uh, a down-to-earth person who shows concern for others, intensely loyal to her friends and family, stable, dependable, helps others in need, organized, noble, and generous, and sympathetic to social and political, and this is you. You gotta stand in that Queen of Pentacles ener energy. Yeah, you're, you're probably prone to getting jokers like this in your life, uh, or women in your life that use you for everything you got, and then they're gone. I'm sorry to say that, but that happens. But it says leave them alone. What is the advice? Because um, they're controlling overbearing, quick, overbearing, quick to anger. And they're closed, they're rigid, and this person creates conflicts and unhappiness for you. This, that's all that person was about. Clock coming. Ugh, can't even talk. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Argues over minor things, immature, not trustworthy. The person's not respected in anybody's eyes, not trustworthy. Maybe you didn't see that coming. You know, because you're Queen of Pentacles, you're a stable individual. You wouldn't think anybody unstable would become up to your life. You know, what are they doing? You're the star. You're, you know, pouring out a cup of emotions. You're just, you know, wanting to make everybody happy. You just want everybody to be happy. But no matter what you, sometimes people, no matter how much you give to them, they're not happy. They're, they won't be happy. Let's see what you're going to be doing. After beginning, you know, you begin, um, they come and took from you. You felt like there was no place to go, like you didn't have any options. They, you know, they come to you out of nowhere. That's a six of wands in reverse. Nine of pentacles, but you're still going to be stable. You're going to be cautious. You're not just going to trust anybody in the future. <laughs> My dogs are really having fun. Sorry about that. I'm not sorry. Knight of Cups. 
Maybe somebody uh, is going to come into your life that's not a cups, looks like he's coming in, um, makes decisions with his heart, and is well-educated and persuasive. Maybe they give you a proposition. This person's considerate and generous. And that is air signs, Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. We'll see what the, if it's not a cup's going to work after all this, this joker in the past. And let's see, the person in the past would be Scorpio uh, stands out because we got the devil card. Um, earth sign, water signs. Hell, we've got them all here. Could have a little bit of a owl. Let's see about this Knight of Cups. Is it going to work with this Knight of Cups? You may lose your virtue, innocence, or money through this man. Do not trust him with your heart and possessions. That's the King of Cups reverse. Not don't trust him with your heart. Oh, Cause he's uh, coming in with some love, but he looks like he's gonna halt, and he he's not too sure. But the outcome with this person, you're not. Shouldn't trust them either. Maybe you need time to heal. Let's get uh, some advice from Alice in Wonderland and we'll get out of here. <laughs> Don't trust this person. You know, you probably need time to heal. That's what I'm thinking. You just need time to heal from people. Looks like everybody's in the same bullshit all in the golden afternoon inspiration creative spark imagination and conception on the bottom of the deck we got find the lesson discover the purpose in the situation trust that you are learning all these people you know were learning lesson Everything that you went through with this person, I bet you won't do it again. And, you know, if you don't know, now you know. So, in the future, just watch out for these individuals, especially when you're a stable person. Uh, watch out for people that come in that are not on the same level as you, want the same things as you. Research this. Don't uh, just jump into anything. All right? Y'all have a good day. Thank you for being here. Like, share, and subscribe. Salt Intuition.